What's up, guys? Back here with another episode of Monster Truck Outlaws Monday Night Freestyle. As you can see, we got the trucks lined up here, getting ready to perform for you guys on this somewhat of a new track. The Outlaw Track Crew has been working a little bit, trying to change some things up. We got a few new competitors. We're going to get ready to start the show. Coming up first, we're going to see Blake Willis coming back. He was in the Mohawk Warrior Fire last time, but this time he's in Mohawk Warrior. Let's see what he can do. Getting ready for his first jump here. Look, he's going for the double car stack. Gets a nice wheel stand. Almost lost it, but he brings it back down. Nice control of Blake Willis. Looking good for the first hit. Let's see what he's got next. Here he comes for the double van stack. Gets some nice air. Hard on the brakes before he hits the backflip ramp. Another good looking hit. Let's see what he's going to do next. Coming down now, getting ready for the container jump. Let's see if he gets some good speed worked up. Looking good. Comes up over it. Nice little wheelie on the back half of it. Comes to a rolling stop. He's going to get lined up and get ready for his next hit. Coming down now, going to hit the garbage truck. See what he can do with that. Get some little bit of air over it. Comes to a stop. He's going to get ready for his next jump. Coming out to the single van stack. Let's see what he can do with this. Comes up and over. Look out. He's going to roll it. And he can't get the save. Look like the back tire got caught up on the van a little bit there. And he rolls it over. Still a pretty good run by Blake Willis. Up next, we'll see Ethan Wagner coming back with his dragon knife. This kid rocked it out last time. Let's see what he can do this time. He saw that van stack. Just got Blake Willis. He said, I'm going straight forward. Let's see if he can get it. Gets a little sideways on it, but he gets over it, and he's going to line up and get ready for his next jump here. Got a little crooked over it, but still on all fours, so he's in good shape. Getting ready now for the double car stag, and he's up and over. What an early rollover for Ethan. That's not what he wanted to do. He usually comes out and rocks the house. Got a nice wheel stand and leaned over to the left a little too, little too much. He couldn't correct, didn't get to save, so he's up and over. Early run for Ethan, but spectacular roll. Still looking good out there. We'll see if we'll see him next time. Well, up next we got Regina Stewart and a Stinger Unleashed making her freestyle debut. Let's see what she can do out here. Getting lined up for the double van stack. Coming up and over. Get some nice air. Looking good for her first jump. Just going to whip it around and get lined up for her next jump. Here she comes now. Looks like she's lining up for the container jump. Plenty of speed coming up and over. Nice air. Good looking jump there. Let's see where she goes next. Coming over here for the garbage truck jump. Let's see what she does. Up and over it nicely. Almost rolls into the van stack, but she's still looking good. She's lining up now for the double car stack. Let's see what she can do with this. Nice, Willie. It goes a little left. Looked like she was going to lose it, but nice control by Regina. She lines up now for that single van stack. Let's see what she can do. <clears throat> looking pretty good over. She got over it nice and neat. Best looking one to get over that so far. Going for the back flip now. Can she do it? And she gets it. She barely gets it. And she's going to be the first woman ever on Monster Truck Outlaws to get the back flip. Way to go, Regina. Up next, we're going to see Jason Craddock bringing the Blue Thunder Zombie back. He raced it in season one of Saturday Night Shootout. Looked good, but he's ready to freestyle it now. See what he does. Going for the garbage truck jump. Nice jump. Best looking one yet. Let's see where he goes next. Coming up here for the container jump. Let's see what he can do with it. Nice looking air comes up and over. Bumps into the van stack a little bit, but still in good shape. Going for the double van stack. Gets up and over it. Looking pretty good. This Blue Thunder Zombie machine runs pretty good. He keeps it top notch. Always a good looking machine. Let's see where he goes next. Coming for that double car stack. Gets a little... A little stumbling on it, but he's still in good shape, and he's going to line up for his next jump. Here he comes now, getting ready for that single van stack. Let's see what he does. Nice done, line, nicely done over it, and he's going to get ready to line up for the backflip here. Let's see what he can do. Can he get it? Here he comes now. Now he gets a little sideways. He's up and over. He gets it. Oh, he, he lands right on Nugget in the zombie. If it was not for zombie being parked there, he would have rolled that truck, but what a save. He's going to give Nugget a hand after that. He's saying, thank you, buddy. Next up, we're going to see Wild Man Ryan Johnson coming back with a Saigon Shaker. Had a killer run last time. Let's see if he can do it again. 
Looks like he's starting off big by going for the container jump. Let's see what he can do. Gets up and over it. Nice air. Looking good for the first jump. Let's see where he goes next. Gonna get lined up for the garbage truck jump. Here he comes up and over. Gets a little sideways over it. Still in good shape though. He's gonna whip it around and get ready for his next jump. That Saigon Shaker truck, awesome looking machine. See what he does next with it. Looks like he's going for the double car stack here. Coming up and over, gets a little stumbled on it. Looks like the looks like the officials might have shut him down. I'm not quite sure. We're gonna see if we can he can refire and get it back started and see where he goes next. Coming here now for the double van stack. Let's see how he does on this. Comes up and over and he shuts down again. I think there might be an issue with the RI tonight. He's gonna try to get it going here again. Got it back fired up, going for the single van jump. Gets a little crooked on it. Keeps it on all fours, though. And even with some motor issues or RI issues, we're going to get him lined back up here. And it looks like he's going to go for the backflip. He got it last time. Can he do it this time? Nice run up and over. He couldn't get it to come back around to him, and he's going to flip the truck over. Wild man Ryan Johnson out here. Got it. Had a few issues in the run, but he still finished it. Still a good run. Up next, we're going to see Timothy Cantwell in his first time out in freestyle with the Bounty Hunter machine. Let's see what he can do. This truck's known for wheelie, so let's see what he does with it. Going for the double van stack to start off. And here he comes. Look at him walk the truck across the van stack. What a nice touch by Timothy Cantwell. Let's see where he goes next. Well, he's lining up for the double car stack. I love this jump. It's such an old school classic for Monster Jam. And he going wheelie over that, too. Nice looking run going here by Timothy. He's lining up for that single van stack now. Let's see what he does with it. Here he comes now. And look out. He's up and he's over. The car caught his back tire and tripped him up and he couldn't save it. Got into the backflip ramp a little bit. But Timothy's still looking good out here. Love well, next we're going to see Nugget and Zombie also making his freestyle appearance. Let's see if he can rot the house out. Lining up for the garbage truck jump now. Here he comes. Up and over. A little slow over it, but he gets over it. Almost lines up for the single van stack, but he changed his mind. Looks like he's going for the container jump here. Coming down the ramp, plenty of speed. Nice air over it, looking good. Gets on the brakes, stays off the backflip ramp. Got some pretty good air off of that. He's looking good so far. Zombie machine's an awesome looking machine. Let's see what he does with it next. Going for the double van stack here. Here he comes now, up and over it. Stumbles a little bit. But he's still running, though, so he's going to line up for his next jump. Go for the double car stack. Let's see if he can get a wheelie like everybody else. Here he comes. Nice, nice wheelie, but he stumbles on a little bit. I think they might have shut him down again. I think there's an issue going on tonight with the RI. Maybe some frequency issues. Not sure we're going to get it figured out. They got him fired back up. Looks like he's going to go now for the single van stack. Let's see what he does with it. Up and over. Nicely done over it. It's been getting a lot of folks tonight, but Nugget made it look easy. And he's going to get ready and line up for the backflip ramp. Let's see what he can do. Here he comes now. Looks good all the way up. Oh, he goes for a double, but he can't do it. Oh, man. He almost pulled off that double if the truck would have come back around to him. That would have been amazing. But still, nonetheless, a great, a great run by Nugget for his first time out. Awesome run. Up next, we're going to see my wife, Emily Graham, coming with the Joker machine. Here she comes now down the ramp for the van stack. I tries to get a little bit of a moonwalk out of it, but the brakes lock up a little too much and slams it back down. Here she comes now lining up for the garbage truck. See what she can do with it. Up and over it. Nicely done. Joker machine, a wild looking machine, but she loves this thing. She's out here trying to rock it out in freestyle. Looks like she's lined up for the container jump now. Here she comes down the ramp. Nice looking air. Barely misses the single van stack. Let's see where she goes next. Lining up here for the double van stack. Gets a wheelie over it. Nice looking wheelie. She's going to whip that thing around and get ready for her next jump here. She's looking pretty good so far out here. Getting ready for the double car stack. Let's see what she can do with that. Uh, stumbles a little bit. Truck took a weird bounce. But she, nonetheless, she gets up and over it. She's going to see... See what she can do next with that Joker machine.
Looks like she's lining up now for the backflip ramp. Let's see if she can become the second woman to do it. She gets a little crooked and she's up and over. Man, it was looking good and she landed down from the ramp and it, that thing turned left all of a sudden and it messed her all up. She cased the side of the ramp. Almost looked like a corkscrew kind of, but she's up and over. Still a good run. Up next, we're going to see Joshua Stewart coming back with a Soldier Fortune. Had a great run last time. Let's see if he can back it up with this run too. Starting off with a double car stack. Here he comes up and over. Nice little wheelie kind of stalls out a little bit over it. But nonetheless, he gets up and over it. Let's see where he goes to next here. Going for the double van stack. He's out here rocking the house with that Soldier Fortune machine. Up and over it. Gets a little bit of a wheel stand. Not much, nothing crazy though. He gets up and over it and gets ready for his next jump. Here he comes now, lining up for the container jump. Plenty of speed up and over it. Nice air. Smooth looking landing. He's looking good out here. The truck's working great. Let's see where he goes next. Lining up for that single van stack coming down the ramp. Here he comes. Oh, he kind of cased it a little. Got a little sideways, but he's still on all fours, so he's going to line up for his next jump. That single van stack has gave a lot of folks some problems tonight. Let's see, he's going over here for the garbage truck jump now. Gets a little sideways, too willing in a little bit, but he's on all four. Lining up now for the backflip. He couldn't get it last time. Let's see if he can get it this time. Coming down now, looking good. Nice rotation. He can't get it. The front wheel jammed into the ground, and he couldn't get it to spin and catch, and he couldn't bring it back. But still a good run by Joshua. And up next, this kid really rocked it out last time. He's the first driver to ever do a backflip on Monster Truck Outlaws. Let's see if he can get it done again here on Monday Night Freestyle. He's starting off with a double stack of cars. What a nice-looking wheel stand. Jalen Prezik out here rocking it out with the Stone Crusher machine. Nice-looking run over the cars. Let's see where he goes next. Looks like the double van stack here. Comes up and over that. A little bit of a wheel stand kind of eases over him a little bit. And he's going to line up for his next jump. Look, looks like he's getting ready for that container jump. Plenty of speed coming down the ramp. Nice looking there. I think that was the biggest air of the night over that. Gets on the brakes. Stays out of the backflip ramp. Let's see. Now he's going for the garbage, garbage truck jump. Up and over it a little sideways, but still in good shape. Now he's going to line up for the single van stack. Coming down now. Up and over. Look out. He's over. He couldn't save it, and that, that car caught his wheel like the rest of them. He's up and over early, but still a great run. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Monday Night Freestyle. Be sure to shoot that subscribe button, and we'll catch you next Monday for another episode. Thank you, guys.